Hello everyone, in this video we'll discuss about what is the difference between i enumerable and i queryable in C sharp. The basic difference between the i enumerable and i queryable is the way it operates the it the way it manipulates the data. i enumerable is the base interface of the i queryable. That means i queryable inherits i enumerable. So what are the features in i enumerable that applies to i queryable but the basic uh, operation the way it manipulates the data is different so remember ai enumerable is a in memory operation while query the data from a database i enumerable executes a select query on the server side load the data in memory on client side and then filter it so data uh, it operates in in memory while query the data from a database i queryable executes the select query on the server side with all the filters in the database side this is the basic difference apart from that i enumerable exists in system dot collection namespace whereas i queryable exists system dot link namespace i enumerable is used to query the data from in memory collections like list array Whenever there is a in-memory collections, i enumerable is a good fit. Whereas in i queryable, it is best to use when we want to query the data from the out memory, like a remote database service collections. i enumerable is suitable link to object and link to XML queries. i queryable is suitable for link to SQL queries. i enumerable does not support lazy loading. Hence, it is not suitable for scenarios like paging. I queryable support lazy loading. Hence, it is suitable for paging scenarios. So, when there is operations for in-memory traversal, so use I enumerable. When there is a use case of paging scenarios, used I queryable. But the first difference which we have listed here, I enumerable use the in-memory and i queryable execute the queries on the server side this is the basic difference thanks for watching